All right, what's up? I'm currently sitting in Virginia Beach um, over up near Central 111 uh, Bar. Uh, I'm right near, uh, I think it's uh, Great Neck and uh, Virginia Beach Boulevard. But anyway, I wanna pull this off my main, pull off my main phone real quick. This is uh, the Mile IQ app, and I hope you can see it. That's Mile IQ. And I've been using the Mile IQ app now since, uh, well, pretty much since I started driving for Uber. I've almost been doing Uber for almost a year and Lyft for about, uh, what, Lyft for about maybe, maybe seven months, maybe. Um, I don't do a lot of Lyft. Lyft is more of a backup for me. Um, I just wanted to share that with you because right now in 2016, as of this moment, at uh, 0103 in the morning on Saturday, December 3rd, I'm at $5,661.74 potential write-off for taxes just on my mileage alone because I've been tracking it with the Mile IQ app. And on this video, I just wanna mention that to you because part of being an independent contractor is, while, there, while there's many negative sides, one of the good sides is I can write that off along with some other things. And I have a wonderful sister-in-law uh, who's wonderful in many ways and she does taxes. This is one of the other ways she's wonderful. Um, so that's one of the benefits of being a rideshare driver. Um, of course, another benefit of driving for Uber and Lyft is, uh, in my case, I, I do have a regular job that I do. Um, you guys know I drive motor coaches. Uh, but like right now, when the bus business is really slow, um, I do Uber and a little bit of Lyft. And even when it's not so slow, I do Uber and a little bit of Lyft. But um, just doing that, or maybe uh, maybe doing Postmates or some other kind of app um, app run um, service. Um, you know, use the Mile IQ app. Now, Mile IQ is not paying me to to say this or promote their products or anything or whatever. Um, and of course I do Uber and Lyft, um, and despite having that issue with Uber uh, recently, um, I'm gonna start sharing my referral codes again for Uber, because uh, it benefits you more to try to share them as opposed to not sharing them. And also sharing my referral code, of course, for Lyft. Uh, for both of those right now in Hampton Roads, you sign up for Uber or Lyft, um, I get money and you get money. Now right now as it currently stands at this moment, last time I read anything, Uber $100 for me, $100 for you if you're in Hampton Roads and you sign up and successfully for Uber. Um, Lyft right now is at $150. Normally Lyft's at $100, but right now they're at $150. Uh, so the same thing with them. Now if you live outside of Hampton Roads and you use my referral codes, keep in mind that for your particular area, the the um, amount uh, is probably going to be higher, um, but make sure you uh, know how that works if you're using someone's referral code from outside the area. Because in some areas, for example, maybe your area is three hundred dollars, maybe your area is seven hundred dollars. Um, I'll get seven hundred dollars, and you could get seven hundred dollars, for example. Um, but just check your app for your particular area because. Uber and Lyft, little itty bitty things here and there, like like model year vehicle, this that, and the other little itty bitty things from market to market are different uh, from market to market. So check your app in your area to see what's different. But I'll leave my referral code uh, on this YouTube video. Um, uh, please like my uh, YouTube page. Please subscribe. I would like to grow my channel. 
and share more about rideshare, but I also talk about other things that interest me and soon I'm going to start back up with uh, doing some reviews of products that I use related to rideshare and also products and services in my everyday normal life that I think are good or that I think might suck uh, that I've come across. So that's it uh, from uh, Virginia Beach, Virginia on the 3rd of December at 107 in the morning. Everyone be safe. Uh, Uber on and Lyft up and again of course mile iq download the mile iq app if you have any kind of business and you're using your vehicle again mile iq is not paying me uh, to say that but download the mile iq uh, from the google play store um, it will benefit you like it's benefiting me right now five thousand six hundred sixty one dollars and seventy four cents i suspect by the time the end of the year it actually hits I will be at about $7,000 in write-offs from that alone. And I only do Uber and Lyft part-time because I have a regular full-time uh, type job. So, all right, be safe. Later.